Well, here I am. I've just been. Look how stressed I look. I've just been to the bottle shop. Need a wine tonight. Oh, God, I look like crap. Pulled up at the um, camping ground here at Avoca. And I thought, well, tonight will be the first night I open up the awning on the van. Not to be. It seems that the chappy who did the handover for me cross-threaded some little windy bit that's supposed to loosen the whole thing on one of the arms and it's just not working. So, um, after much swearing and then thinking how convenient I'm only 45 minutes away from where I bought the van from, tomorrow we'll be going via Ballarat to see them again so they can fix the jolly thing. Um, I did actually have to then move the van out of the sun and pop it into, uh, look how pretty this is if I turn this around. That's where I'm heading. That's where the van is. So um, we've moved the van. I've left it attached to the car though because I'm the only one there. It's just for safety's sake. As he's very comfy there now that I'm in the shade. And she travelled very well today, I'm happy to say. So here we are, day three. And uh, I can't do a written blog because I've got no internet. So, oh, I'm on solar, so I can't use a computer. So, um, oh, look how pretty that is. Look, I'll turn that around, look. It's very pretty. I don't know if you could see that then. So anyway, signing off. They're doing chai, chai tea, tai chi in the gardens here. So, um, I'll talk to you tomorrow, no doubt, from, uh, oh, God, where will I be? Creswick, maybe. Who knows? Bendigo the night after, I know that much. Anyway, off I go. Have a glass of wine. Ta-da.